Good evening. Well, let me start by saying new Mets, same as old Mets. Get used to saying that plenty of times this year. This bullpen stinks. And also, by the way, this manager's got to go. He's got to go. They got to fire him. Fire him. 77 pitches, the best pitcher in baseball that any other team would kill to have. Surefire Hall of Famer, dominant arm, 77 pitches through six innings. You couldn't have him go at least one or two more innings. You take him out. It's the first game of the season. I understand that you want to preserve it. It's a long season, but you got to set the tone. I mean, Jacob DeGrom's your best pitcher. He's not only your best pitcher, he's the best pitcher in baseball. Screw Trevor Bauer. It's Jacob DeGrom. Unbelievable. Eighth inning, he should have still been out there at the, with the way he was pitching. You're, you, you're paying him big bucks. He's your ace. You, you start off by giving him 100 pitches. He need, You know, why not? You set the tone. You set the tone first game of the season. You make a statement. Okay, and then you, and then you, and then the game could have been two nothing in the ninth inning, whatever. Then you give it to the to the to the closer. I, I know I've said it before that I don't trust Diaz, and I still don't. But either way, you at least can say, okay, you set it up to the closer. And I would I wouldn't have killed Rojas if Diaz blew the game in the ninth. But I'm killing him now. This, he's got to go. This this manager is over his is in over his head. I don't know why Steve Cohen kept running back. This guy stinks. He's an awful manager. They blew it, and they're going to continue to blow games all year. This is this is the franchise. This is the New York Mets. These are the New York Mets. This bullpen is going to cost the Mets this season. I've said it before. And I know I, I got some fellow Met fans who who disagreed with me and said, "Oh no, they're fine. They got enough." Really? The one supposedly surefire middle reliever, Trevor May. Okay, gets a first uh, first uh, batter strikeout. Okay, cool. Next batter walk. Next batter base hit. Next batter base hit. And they were hard hits. They not weren't lucky. They, they they weren't lucky singles. They were hard hits. Hard hits. It wasn't fooling anybody. And then our one uh, lefty reliever we have was he come in, face Bryce Harper. First bit, hits him on the hits, hits him on the knee. Sure. We have enough. That's the Mets bullpen. They stink. They are going to ruin a good lineup. A good rotation, and if I'm Jacob Degrom, I don't know how much more I can take. Thirty-two, I believe it's thirty-two blown games by this god awful freaking bullpen. Sucks. And. You know what? I, I, and, I, and I'm going to mention a little bit about James McCann's blunder. Uh, well, that 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 really was a difference right there. But still, it shouldn't even have been to that point. The bullpen couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Couldn't get the job done. And it's on the manager because Degrom should have started the eighth inning. He should have at the rate he was going. He should have. He would have been at less than 100 pitches at the end of the eighth inning at the rate he was going. Maybe not, but he probably would at the rate he was. You know, he was facing the bottom third of the order. He was he he had it. He's your best pitcher. He's the best pitcher in baseball. He should have been out there for the eighth inning. I don't I don't I don't care. I don't care. You set the tone for the beginning of the season. And there are fans saying, hey, you know, it's 162 games. You can't freak out. Well, you know what? Every diehard Met fan knows how many times this team has blown it for Jacob DeGrom. And how many times that this team has puked. This is a franchise that blew a seven-game lead with 17 left to go in 2007. 
but it's okay. We got a, we, you know, Trevor May, you know, ever Aaron Loop. Okay, you know, we oh, we know, but you're familiar, Batances. Nah, we got enough in the bullpen. I called it. This bullpen. I'm saying it now. This bullpen sucks. And yeah, Guillaume, I, this manager was overthinking it. Why was Guillaume in the game playing third? And yet McCann, McCann, McCann was the catcher. He, he blew. He dropped that ball. He flat out dropped it. So yeah, like I said, that's and the the defense. We we always talked about the the great seven, seven inning defense. Um, defense they had for seven innings in the eighth inning they implode. You know what? That's just the Mets way. They're going to find a way to blow games. That's always what they've done. That's always what they're going to do. Maybe it's just a black cloud over this franchise. And I'm calling. And, and it, would it surprise me if they get swept in Philly and the, and tomorrow Strowman gets bout, gets gets ousted and he gets rocked? No. The Phillies are gonna are gonna I I I wouldn't surprise if we start 0 3. Wouldn't surprise me. Would not surprise me. We should have won this game tonight. Bad managing, terrible bullpen. What else is new with this freaking franchise? What else is new? And only in the fourth inning, Kevin Pillar bases loaded, one out, double play. We could have blown the game open. We could have blown it open, and we didn't do it. Ladies and gentlemen, the Steve Cohen era, nothing has changed. The 2021 New York Mets, it's going to be the same freaking season that it's always been. This franchise is never, ever, ever going to win a championship. We'll be lucky to sniff a wild card. We'll be lucky to come close. You puke games like that, that sets the tone for the season. Trevor May sucked. I was not impressed. He sucked. Aaron Loop, first batter. Yeah, yeah, hit Bryce Harper on the knee. You can't throw a freaking strike. Anyways, another long season for the Mets. What can I say?